Hey guys, welcome back to November day four and five. I'm just gonna give you a recap of what happened yesterday and why you don't have a video today. Um, so, I picked my aunt up from the airport at like 12 o'clock last night. Cause I worked from three to 12, but um, since I was done early, I was able to leave early. So I left at work like around 11.30. And I picked them up from the airport, my aunt and her husband. So we like got them, then they're like, they wanna go to Walmart. So I was like, okay, cool, no problem. Went to Walmart and then they were, um, went to their hotel, which was really close to Walmart. So we left Walmart like around 1.30 in the morning, I believe, like something like that. So I went to Walmart, they got their stuff. Then we went to the hotel. Went to the hotel, they put their bags down, they were hungry. Went across, there's like a Denny's 24 hours. By this time, it might be like two o'clock or so. And order their food. But the thing about it, that Denny was extremely short staffed because this is the week of Uber Soaker Cruise and it actually went here. So they were very short staffed because the hotel that's hold, holding everybody for the Uber Soaker Cruise was right across the street from Denny's. They only had one waiter, um, one cook, and then the manager. And it was, the place was full of VI people, Trini people, Caribbean people. It was crazy. And this one poor guy, he had to serve everybody. So we got there before like the big rush, but still like he even messed up our order. We ended up having to go back, which it was across the street. So it was no problem. But then there was like, oh, you guys didn't order that. And we're like, look at the receipt because they didn't give us a receipt. So he looked at the receipt and he was like, oh, okay, yeah, you did order it. So we had to get our extra piece of food or whatever. We, le we ended up leaving there like, for the second time, like around three something. And I told my aunt, cause they bought me food and everything. I was like, I can't eat here because if I eat, <laughs> I have to sleep. So she was like, okay. She was like, thank you so much and everything. But they're leaving for the crew, but like 12 o'clock today. And it's a little, it's 10, 25. I didn't change the time in my car yet since daylight savings is Sunday. It still says um, 11, but yeah. So they're like, it was crazy last night. A whole bunch of drunk people. I was like, man, I wish I was going, but I'll be on there next year, so I'll be all right. But it was crazy. But yeah. And then another crazy thing happened to me yesterday too. I'm so tired, that's why I'm like, I feel like I sound monotone. But my ex-best friend actually reached out to me yesterday and I didn't know what to do. Like, I didn't know to call him back or what. And I didn't call him back. I just text him. And I was like, who is this? Even though I knew it was him, I knew it was his number. <laughs> so I was like, this number looks so familiar. It looks so familiar. And I went back in my phone and I looked and I was like, I saw like, old text messages and I was just like, okay, this is him. So I was like, who is this? I got a call from this number or whatever. Da, da, da. And he told me, asking how I'm doing and then he's, he was like he did think about me a lot and all this stuff and we basically caught up and yeah it's been about 10 months since we actually spoke so it was kind of weird we never like took that long of a time without talking so it was very weird but we're gonna hang out today so I'll let you guys see some of that. I won't let you guys see him, but I'll let you guys see some of that. It was nice to catch up and stuff. And um, he just really needs a friend right now. So I'm just going to put my pride aside and just be there for him. But yeah. Anyway, I'm on the way to work right now. It is 1027. I have to be there for 11. I left the house very late because I was tired. But yeah, I just feel like I look a mess. I feel a mess and tired. I mean, I'm feeling a lot better than I did when I woke up. I guess as the, the day goes by, goes on, I will like get more energy and stuff. But yeah, I went to sleep at like almost five this morning and I woke up at 9.30. Cause I was like, I'm not waking up at nine. I'm gonna have to get ready in, in 30 minutes. But yeah, anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Hey guys, it's me again. <laughs> um i'm home now i got ready and everything for like um us going out um 
yeah, I'm kind of nervous because I haven't seen him in like 10 months or so. I haven't spoken to him in 10 months. Like up until yesterday, it's been like almost 10 months. So I hope it's not awkward. I mean, we were best friends for almost five years. So I mean, talking to him yesterday, I didn't feel no type of way, but you know, I just, I don't know. <laughs> well, I will pick up the camera when I get there. Um, I'm going to be in the same exact area that I was last night. Four o'clock this morning <laughs> but anyway i'll talk to y'all later